what is up YouTube so today I couldn't find any shiny face I looked all week long so today I'm doing the Salamence 10 and Dragonite 10 so these are from Dollar General not hard to find I mean actually they kind of are I know I have a couple of Dollar Generals that I absolutely know that sells these so I just go to them like all the time like I seem to always find these uh, these are the last ones there so um it's kind of funny the cash register person also told me they were they're like they're very popular it's really hard to find so uh um yeah i, kind of, I think I kind of laughed because like i haven't found anything like all week like there's been absolutely zero anything to buy so we'll do these two some all right so mess what a mess anyways two lost thunder unified minds cosmic clips unified minds unified minds probably clips two evolutions and our cosmic eclipse um i like these pack selection honestly like it's probably some of the best packs out there um dollar journal stuff only get three cards per pack but it's whatever you know it's something fun to open up because you know when you get that itch to open up stuff you gotta do it right so let's see what we can get Uh, reverse jump bluff. Very nice. Rare. Right there. Right away. Um, obviously you're not guaranteed a rare in these. Which is kind of unfortunate. But, it, you know, what, what do you expect? They're a dollar. I mean, I like these because, <laughs> well, they're cheap. Best card's going to be in the last. Right there. Another rare. Look at that. Um, in my personal opinion, I like to buy them because, you know, my, uh, for ten dollars, you know, I get to open up packs, which is funny. And it's just more about just opening the packs and satisfying that need to want to buy something. Cause uh, when it's, when it's nothing to find, nice holiday chop. Look at that. Yes. Okay. When you can't find anything, it's a uh, frustrating. Let's just say the least. Especially when you're just like, I just want to find something. I don't even care what it is right now. I don't even care what it said it is. I just want to find something. And Dupiter and Domais. Nothing really too special there. Um, and the way I see it, because, you know, I am new at making videos. This is kind of like a good, like, way to just keep making videos so I can learn how to do it. Um, get better and better as I go along. To just, you know, so why not just use Dollar General cards? Um, got a rare. Look at that. And Dark City. Um, besides, these are, like, Unified Minds, like, probably one of my favorite sets. Um, got overshadowed. There we go. Got overshadowed by Hidden Fates. Came out right when, like, right when Hidden Fates was, like, booming. So, it never got any traction whatsoever. But, you know, um, Me Too and Mew. Who doesn't love Me Too and Mew? Cosmic Clips, same thing. Um, Cosmic Clips was the last set of the year. That year, and the same thing. Hidden Fates was right there and just took over everything. And these sets kind of got kind of forgotten, honestly. And now people are kind of looking at them like, these are really good play sets. Like, a lot of good play cards here. And Evolution's okay. There we go. Let's go get that Charizard, right? That reverse Hollow Charizard. How it dies in here, but you know, you can. You can open dream, right? Well, just uh, uh ooh, reverse play whack. Eh, it's not Charizard, but it's something. Another evolutions. Uh, again, reverse Charizard, or even the regular Charizard. I wouldn't care even the Mega Charizard. I mean, we all like Charizard, so let's see if we can get something. Drowsy, Green Link, I like the buzz. Common was a rare, an original set, and Cosmic Eclipse again. And you can kind of see how they have the little tabs where they, they were actually selling them. I think it's kind of funny when I see them in these tens. Because, just because, like, oh, well, they clearly couldn't sell them. So we'll just throw all of them in tens, and now everybody wants them. So everybody wants cards, so it's hard. And Wilmer and that thingy. And then Dragonite. Um, me, personally, I personally think that Dragonite 10 is usually the best 10. Usually it's better pulls, in my opinion. Salamence seems like I never get anything good out of it. Dragonite. 
I like the dragon meat. And obviously the same packs. So, I think we're going to end on evolutions because evolutions is where it's at anyway. Lost Thunder. Um, Lost Thunder, I mean, sadly enough, Lost Thunder was a set that I don't have hardly any of. I, uh, it was a set that I didn't have any money at the time. And this was just, I was, wasn't was really into Pokemon cars for sale. I was more into Pokemon Go. Look at that rare, rare tick. Yeah, rare. And, uh, this was just a time where I just didn't have any free money to spend on cards, and Pogo was free, and that was it. Like, I collected before this set, and I collected after this set, but this set kind of got abandoned by, by me, honestly. I mean, there are some pretty cool cards in there. You know, there's a, a Lugia. That's wanted. You can find mines. You and me, too. Come on now. But, uh, oh, reverse Graggy. It's a something. It's a hit. It's a hit. I'm gonna hate myself. I don't know if I, uh, don't pull anything good. Nah. Um, to be honest with you, I don't think I've pulled really anything really too fantastic out of Dollar General packs ever. But, like I said, it gets you that itch that makes you wanna at least be able to see things. Pokemon cards being pulled. It's kinda nice. I haven't found a dollar general around me that actually sells like individual packs. I've only found the tens, which personally, I don't mind buying the tens. Ooh, reverse. Rare. Look at that. Hollow rare. I don't mind buying the tens because, hey, the packs can't be weighed. And uh, unfortunately, when it comes to these things, it's not that hard to weigh a pack. Like, oh, this pack weighs generally a little heavier because there's, there's obviously a hollow in there. So, that's one positive thing about getting tens. And then I can also just store stuff in the tens. I like the small tens. Reverse rare. Got a rare. Um, Cosmic Clubs. Ooh. I want an ultra rare though. Where's my ultra rare at? I need one ultra rare. Come on now. Those pass. Roxy and Snow Run. Sad. Cosmic Clubs again. Get the babies. Uh, Woo Bat and her dirt dirt. And we're on the last two. We've got ev evolutions. Um, yeah, let's hope for something. I mean, we got a decent little stack of pools, which, you know, you think about it, for $10, you get 10 packs. Obviously, you know, you get three cards a pack, you get 30 cards. If I were to spend the same $10 at a retail store, um, I'm only going to be able to buy two packs, which would be like 22 cards. So you're getting a little bit better deal in my opinion and honestly like you have a chance to get a rare in every single one of these packs I mean, you never know you might get something really nice um just in dollar packs the choke and ooh oh. hitmonchan i'm not a huge fan of the sparkle that they have on these uh they, they tried getting too old what, what they should have done should have put the cosmic foil on here you know like they did in base set too that would have been cooler i that they're uh they're, that version of hollow is in my opinion, not exactly the best looking version of Hollow there is. And for the last pack, we got Weedle, Dove Spray, and another rare. Another Hollow rare. Alright, well, that's all I have today. So, I mean, that was fun. I mean, at least I got a little bit of my, my itch in to actually open up something. I haven't got to open up anything all week. Um, cards are really, really hard to find, unfortunately. But... You know, I actually really love doing um, Dollar General cards and Dollar Tree cards just because they're fun. You know, they, they uh, you can get anything and they're cheap. You know, why not? I, mean, I only spent me 20 bucks just buying two tens. I mean, that's fun, right? I mean, what's 20 bucks, right? Anyway, um, thanks for watching and uh, until next time.